How many women do you think you've catfished? That's quite a few. More than 10? Yes. More than 40? Yes. A hundred? More than that. More than what? More than a hundred. Yes. Over how many years? Since I was like 19. That's 15 years. Yes. Wow. We're only 14 minutes away from Mystery Man's Who house. Who is this guy? I we don't know don't want to know who this guy is. I got butterflies in my stomach. Like. We don't know how serious this guy is about you or not. Right. He might have very real feelings for you. It all depends on how will he accept me catfishing him, so. Let's talk about Carrie for a second. Right. This guy uh -huh. is nervous about meeting Carrie. Oh, right. Right. I'm just tell him I'm sorry and I'm just hoping for the best. We are about to pull up. Yeah, we're real, real close now. Oh, man. This is it. All right. Whew. Nervous. Let's do it. Don't hold back. Rip off the Band-Aid. Mm. Let me just scope it out. OK. I see someone. Uh-oh, someone's coming. Oh, how you doing? How you doing? Just so we're clear, you're the person that Carrie has been talking to. Yes. So I think you should just come out here and we can sort all this out. Yeah, man. Come on out here. This is Carrie. Oh, my God. So, are you serious? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Really, Terrence? And I didn't know it was you. You know this guy? Man, yeah. this is crazy. How do you know this guy? We dated like 10, 11 years ago. What? This is crazy. This ain't right. That's what it is. It's not right. You catfish me. Well, you catfish yeah, him, too. Yeah, but still, though. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So you had a fake profile. Yes. And messaged her fake profile. And it just so happened that you guys actually used to date? Man, that was a long it time ago. It was so ago. long ago. Are you serious, man? Oh, my god. Wait, wait, time out. You used to live in St. Louis. I used to live with my mother in St. Louis. OK. I mean, this is a first. I'm like, oh, my This is crazy. This was you the whole you guys, time? This is destiny. No, uh -uh. no. It was a How long bad, were you guys bad did relationship. It? it was bad relationship. Yes, yes it, was it was really bad. While we were together, he had three kids on me. You told me you don't even have any kids. You have a lot of kids. How many kids do you have? You have four. He had all those kids on me. Really? Yes. He was just a H O E. That's all he was. Tally ho. Tally ho. There you go. How did you make the tally profile? It wasn't originally me. It was one of my friends. He made the profile. Do I know your friend? Danielle or? or... Danielle? I, I'd rather not say his name. Wait, how did the profile start? I had a buddy who was using the profile to get females off of it. Why was he using Tally's picture? That's something I don't know. And I asked him about it. He was like, man, look, it's just getting me females. So I'm you know... like, OK, cool. You don't know Tally? No, I don't really know. How long have you been using the account? About a year and a half. And who was using it before you? And one of my friends was using it. So it's just like a community I, thing that you just pass on? I just on. don't understand. Why are you guys like using this profile? Why don't you just make a new one? I mean, Because this one works. So what, what do you get out of this? Definitely didn't get what I wanted. Like, I need a break. Yeah. I'm gonna say. This is crazy, man. So you've already had a relationship with her. Yes. It was... You don't want to revisit that. No. <laughs> no. What happened with this guy? <laughs> he hurt me really bad. I was going to marry him with everything. It's been so bad. And you dated Shaquille for four and a half years, man. 
But if I knew it was her, I was like, nah, no way. God, man. I actually love Shaquilla, but I messed things up. But it got to the point where I just had to walk away. This is his life. This is all the females that he's cheated with me or he met them online. I met them online. It ended kind of crazy. It got to the point where she started bleaching clothes. Bleaching clothes? Yes. Like, taking a knife, ripping up my shoes and stuff. I was like, man, and she pretended like she didn't want me to go, but I'm like, man, I can't do this. And so that's how I'm like, females at my house and everything. It's just like. <laughs> it wasn't just me. I mean, this times I came home and Shaquille was in the bed with another dude, drunk. I mean, guess we did each other, but man, this kind of crazy. <laughs> so you were really in love with this guy. And what did you like about Carrie? Carrie was more caring. She'll talk to you. It ain't no lies or whatever. It felt like it wasn't no lies. You know, I told her things that I wouldn't even tell nobody else. I'm gonna go out there. Just stay in here as long as you need. <sighs> Come on out when you're ready. And you dated Shaquilla for five years? Yeah, five years. He dated for five years. He had kids with other people. Sounds like you did some things that were really messed up. Yeah, I did. And she really hurt her. Yeah, and I apologize for what happened in the past. I can only apologize for the past. I can't change it. What about now? Like, What about it? You tell me. You just gonna stand there and keep looking? Or you gonna say something? What is it to say? All right, this was pretty weird. Yeah. Why don't we just see how we feel tomorrow? All right. All right. That was pretty messed up. Oh my God, if I knew this, I wouldn't even came up here. Can you be sure that I'm I mean, when you forget a person, you forget a person, especially with the shit, all the shit you done done. May you stay the same. I mean, like, this good guy, you're being to care with. Why you couldn't be this good guy to me? I just want to ask him some questions. We can go see him tomorrow if you want to. Oh, wow. It's a new day. A new day. Not a lot of stuff on this show sur surprises us anymore. But this really was a surprise. I can't believe that it was him. I talked right. to Levante. He still don't believe it. Like, how did that happen? And I was like, it's that's what amazing. I'm like. It's crazy. I mean, maybe when I had the carry profile, I was like friending people that I knew, like my family. Like, I had a lot of my family. I had a lot of my real friends. Like, I was just trying to make the page look real, so maybe he just found me on one of his friend's page. That's all I can think of. Whatever connection that you obviously had in the past, even as separate people pretending to be, you know, pretty different than you actually are, you still were drawn to each other. You still connected and felt love towards each other, treating each other the way that you probably wish you had been treating each other back then. That's what made me break down like that because the way that he talked to Carrie, he never talked to me like that. The way you showed your feelings, I was like, wow, you do all this stuff for Carrie. You ain't treat me like that. You wasn't good to me like that. Why are you like being like this to a person you don't even know? But you know that he would say exactly the same thing about you, that she was nothing like yeah. Carrie. Carrie listened, she's compassionate, She's powerful and independent, mm -hmm. and he was very attracted to that. Yeah. I'm not gonna push you towards getting back together with Terrence I or not. You get, no. But if you could genuinely forgive him and really kind of like let that pain and hurt go, that'll feel amazing. All right, I'll try. I'm gonna try. Yeah. Hey, man. All right, thanks. How you doing? 
I'm doing all right. I'm sure this is all pretty weird. Yeah. The whole situation, why, you know, I kind of, like, feel up about it is because, like, the way you treated Carrie, like, okay. why you didn't just treat me like that? You would have been the perfect person if it wasn't for, you know, the, your, your bad cheating habit. We probably would have still been together to this day, but... I was young. I don't really think about treating no female right or nothing like that. I was young. I was just coming home from college. I mean, I changed over the years. You told me a little bit yesterday about what you loved so much about Carrie. I think it would be great for Shaquilla to hear some of the things you were saying about Carrie. Carrie was the total opposite of Shaquilla. She was more forthcoming. She would talk to you. Carrie was a person that opened up. So she listened? Yeah, she listened more. Shaquilla, what did you really like about Tally? It was sweet, caring, loving. You know, when I'm having problems at work, I call him and he'll, you know, calm me down. You don't get too many guys like that, so. I ain't never had no, no man to, to say the stuff that he say to me, tell me he loved me before we hang up. Yeah, I was his, you know, his little, his boo, he was mine. Which is, again, kind of the opposite of your image of Terrence. Yes. He was doing other things, and you weren't number one. Mm-mm. I guess I just want to challenge both of you. Maybe there is a part of Tally that you've learned to be. Maybe there's a part of you that is Carrie, and you guys both offered something to someone else that you didn't even think you really had. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I guess I could try to, you know, be more like what I pretended to be. Maybe I could actually be more like I was with Carrie that hey. Just gotta yeah. put in the work. Look, only thing I can do is, man, I can apologize. I apologize too. I mean, we both did stuff to each other. I don't believe in that destiny, that with no, that not, all that I, stuff, so no, I'm not gonna say either. that yeah. it was meant, but you really did love Carrie. Hmm. It's not yeah. easy wow. Be a friend when you should All right, well, look, I mean, this could have gone way worse. Yeah. I think you guys are obviously grown up. You're ready to let the past be the past. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, I thought there was a chance that this could have worked out. Start off as friends and see where it goes from there. It was nice seeing you again. All right. All right. No more catfishing. I'm done. <laughs>
Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Jay. Yeah. Or James. Huh? Jay. Just Jay. Oh, okay. Didn't get a chance to meet you yesterday, but you let us in. Yeah, I saw you yesterday. Did you, did anyone mention what we were doing around here? They said you were looking for somebody. I think there's a chance you may have been talking to our friend Angel. Do you know who she is? No. You don't know who she is? No, I do not. She's been talking to someone in Valdasa. She's become very close with him. And he said he worked here. And a couple things sort of point us to you. But your name is James Williams, right? My legal name? Yeah. Yeah, how do y'all know my legal name? The number that Angel's been texting and talking to is registered to James Williams. And Cap confirmed that that's also your name. Uh, so I'm pretty sure it's you that Angel's been talking to. Right. Yes. Okay, so that is you. Yes. So you've been calling yourself Antonio. Yes. I need a break. All right. Uh. <sighs> I think you can understand why she might be upset. Yes. I can understand. Okay. I'm gonna go with Angel. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Obviously, you're not the guy in the photos. Angel's very invested in this, both yeah. emotionally and financially, huh. and you have not been honest with her. No, I have not. She, I think, deserves to know what's up. You OK? That's his voice. That's him? Yes. I'm sorry. For him to like pretend that he didn't even know you is so stupid. I'm so sorry. Like, put me through all this for what? I sent you money. Like, I want it back. I want to sit down and get answers of why. Are you ready to go back in and talk to him? Yeah. OK. You're taking money from Angel. That was offered to me. It was never my intention. Well, OK, but she's offered because you've suggested you needed money. I was just telling her what I was going through. I know, but she sent you almost $400. And when she sent it to you, you took it. Yes. We kind of want to sit down so we can get some answers. I think Angel's ready. Can we just set some chairs up? Mm -hmm. So you're from Valdosta? Yes. Yeah. How old are you? I'm 34. And are you married? I'm not married. Why then, when we called you on your house phone, did your wife answer? House? I don't have a house. You're not married? Do you live with someone? Nobody living with me, and I'm not married. OK, well, it could have been a weird mix-up. Sometimes these websites aren't perfect. Whose bank account information did you give me? Do you remember sending her to the Verizon store? Yeah, that was my bank account information. But why can't you just pay your bill? I wasn't able to make it to the store that day, honestly. Do you even have a daughter? Yes, I have a daughter. I can show you pictures of her. How many women do you think you've catfished? That's quite a few. More than 10? Yes. More than 40? Yes. More, 100? More than that. More than, wow. More than 100? Yes. Over how many years? Since I was like 19. That's 15 years? Yes. Wow. Why did you tell me that you love me? Like, are your feelings even real, or were you just saying that? I honestly love you as a person, honestly, but not romantically. Why say it to me? You really led me on to believe like you were somebody like that I could make a future with. It was just basically a game. No, it's not a game for me. Do you feel bad? Yes, I do feel bad. That's hard to believe when you admit that you've been doing this for 15 years to hundreds of women. Like, yeah. it just sounds like you're a con artist. It's never about the money for me. If it's not about the money, then why send a picture of Antonio in the hospital and say, if I don't, if he doesn't get money, he's going to? If you love me, you would send the money. If you love my friend, you would send the money. Those messages I don't remember, honestly, I don't. She remembers. Every story that I told you, I was just telling you what I was going through at that time. And I didn't ask you that money. 
we offer. You gave her your cash app information. Right. So you are asking for money. If you're getting- She asked for No, like I said, I would have to see because I was going through things that I had to pay for and you got upset if I couldn't help. I'm a single mother. You know, like I barely have money. I've literally sent you my last $10 and I went without. I honestly don't recall that message that you're talking about. I honestly don't. But the intention is never to scam anyone. But that's not true. Because you've talked to hundreds of people. Are you ready to, like, be real about it? I'm honestly not pretending. I've done some deceiving things, honestly. Which I can't say it back, and I do feel sorry for. But honestly, it started off as a coping mechanism for me. I hid behind this picture. I was bullied in school because I was always bigger. That was a coping mechanism. I was bullied, but I'm not going to hide behind a picture and treat people the way that I got treated. That's not right. I want to believe that you're using this as a coping mechanism. But like, do you know how we know who you are? It's because you were bragging to someone that worked at the club and saying, like, I got all these girls and they're my trophies. That doesn't sound like someone that's going through a hard time. That sounds like you are taking people as trophies. They're not trophies. Did you say that? I've never expressed them as trophies. But I can admit that I have a problem. I honestly want to stop. If you would allow me to be your friend as me, I would love to. I don't think that's possible. You've lost my trust completely. I'm truly sorry, like, honestly, for all of this. Maybe you can start regaining her trust by repaying her. That's like a very specific, clear way that you can repay your debt. And I want to believe you that you're ready to, like, finally stop. But you got to be ready now to prove it. Is there anything else that you want to say, or are we? I don't think so. All right. Thank you for talking and, and admitting and coming clean and, and explaining all this. All right, man. See you around. Thank More you, cat fishing. Yeah. Thank you, Cap. Thanks for helping us clear that up. Hey, no problem. Thank you so much. Yeah, I'll be your old child. How do you feel about all that? How is that a coping method? I would believe him if he weren't making out financially. He's the most manipulative catfish you've ever had. What's next for Angel? Working on me, my daughter, and just going to school. No new friends? No. Is that where we're at right now? Yeah, no new friends. Hey! Hey! What's up, Angel? Have you spoken to James? He texts me like ever so often, huh. but I have no feelings. So has James offered to pay you back at all? He said that he was going to, but it's become a thing over time. So. Yeah, I'm not going to hold my breath for that one. Are you talking to anyone now? I have a friend that I've been talking to. He's really nice. Wait a second. Is this an uh, internet relationship? Yeah. We've got to video chat, we've got to everything, so I know he's real. All right, good. Check, check, check. All right, Angel, hang in there, okay? All right, I will. Bye. 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 Hello. Whoa, James. Hey, man. What's been going on since we all last met up? I've retired. You retired? So Antonio <laughs> is gone or what? Yeah, he's gone. It's a struggle sometimes, but it's a relief. Yeah, I think that's probably best just for, for everybody. Yes. Yeah. And what about Angel? There was some money involved. Have you ever tried and pay her back some of that? Yes, yeah, so I'm working towards it. It doesn't have to be all at once. Pay her oh. back. I'm working on it. No more fake profiles, no more romance scamming. You really have to stop asking people for money. Yeah. Take it easy, man. You too. Bye. Bye.